am really excited for this game. Why stay earthbound when prosperity awaits you in the stars? Come to Halcyon, the only colony on the edge of the frontier, owned and operated by corporations. A trip of ten short years will feel like mere minutes, thanks to the comfort and safety of your very own hibernation chamber. You'll wake up in a perfect society designed to maximize your productivity with guaranteed full employment. With only a minor term of service, you will become the master of your own destiny when you go out of this world to the Halcyon Colony. Breach of Hope Security Corridor. Well, hello, Crispy. How are you? Have you played this game? I'm probably going to be a little bit, you know, focused on it, but I just wanted to say hello. Hundreds of thousands of colonists left to drift out here forever just to keep from damaging the board's bottom line. Disgraceful. I would say most close to me, what kind of a person I am, Tossball Team Mascot. There isn't a problem in all the cosmos that Team Spirit and a big stick couldn't solve together. Your last major head injury in the field knocked some extra cheer into you when you vote. Okay, that sounds a lot like me. And you've been a rising star in Tossball's competitive mascot food chain ever since. All right. It doesn't matter that no one knows your face under your mask. You share the glory with the team. No one can see you <laughs> I like that. inside of a mascot suit. James Heaney. God, that was hard to come to a decision on. Okay. Starting the game. Looks to be your lucky day, my friend. Wait, what's happening? Am I being jettisoned out into space? Not likely, bootlickers. <sighs> Initiate skip jump. Terra 2, orbiting laboratory, Halcyon Station, I think it said. Status, structural integrity down 25%. Power levels down <sighs> it Shit. This sounds like Subnautica. It's like almost the exact same opening, except you splash into this watery planet. Ah, there you are. Wondering what's going on, eh? Bit of bad news there, I'm afraid. Your colony ship was inexplicably knocked out of skip space and forced to complete its journey at sublight speeds. This means that you and every other colonist on the Hope have been in suspended animation for 70 years, give or take. Normally, <laughs> reviving someone after so long leads to some quite horrifying results. It's called explosive cell death, but it's really more of a liquefaction. Something wrong? Oh, yes, well, not to worry. I've pumped your body full of a special concoction I devised to keep you from dying so horrifically. Hopefully at all, but uh, I guess we'll see here. Yeah? Unfortunately, I used the last of my chemical supplies saving you. 
I know it's a lot to ask, but I must have your help securing more if we're to save the rest of your fellow colonists. I'd see it done myself, of course, but the board has a sizable bounty on my head. Now, my ship is inoperative, but I've managed to hire a smuggler to help you out. He'll be... Oh, I see we're in position. Good luck! Wait, what? That's... <laughs> he can't even get his, his AirPod to work? This is pretty crazy. One thing I'm going to make note of is they're still printing papers of people's faces. Wouldn't they just have, like, hologram pictures in the future? It kind of looks like alternate... I guess it would be Earth. They said leave Earth. Maybe it's Can an alternate future. Is this thing working? Ah, there you are. Now, uh, where were we? Oh, yes, the smuggler. His name is Hawthorne, and he should be waiting for you at the landing site. He's to be your uh, chauffeur, so to speak. And not to worry, I'm told he's a specialist. Dashing gunslinger, one of a kind ship, that sort of thing. You'll like him, I'm sure. I've also outfitted you with a simple wireless monitor, so I can track your progress. I'll check in with you as soon as you land. Good luck. I'm all colonists are counting on you. I think he's a good guy, but I'm not entirely sold yet. My guess is this is not where I expected to land. cool standard tutorial it's gonna get me to duck I'm probably gonna have to learn how to sprint to get out of the way of something I guess I appreciate that in games but how often does somebody really need like they should just be like oh this is the same as every other game you've ever played except uh, here's the differences but whatever I mean I've sprinted how much do you want me to sprint I sprint back Uh-oh. Is this person dead? Adreno. While sneaking, use tall grass or rocks to cover and hide from... So that's important. Sometimes you can't count on a game uh, accounting for sneaking. Knowing that this does count means uh, I should be able to sneak up on somebody. Is there any food? I guess you can't just pick up anything or else I would have been able to pick up that pan. Well, I certainly don't want to get caught by these guys. The awareness meter over enemy heads tell you if they are unaware. That's very nice. It's that triangle thing that fills up. Kind of like, uh, you know, I think Assassin's Creed, probably Metal Gear Solid. I feel like there's... Oh! Oh, 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 oh. I think he calmed down. I take that? I don't need it. I, if they wanted me to pick it up, they would have taught me how to pick it up. Uh-oh, is this one of those horrifying things that happens to you? Now. You've been frozen for a while. There's bound to be unforeseen side effects. I can't make that jump. It's gonna hurt me bad. Is it really where I'm supposed to go? It's gonna kill me! 
No, no, no. I have low health. Okay, they're going to teach me how to help myself. Use the emergency medicinal... Medicinal... Oh, I couldn't read it that fast? Jeez. All right. I guess that was it. Just... I guess I hit F and that did it for me. Hey, you. Come here. All right. You've tried the best now. Now try the rest. Spacer's choice. Oh, wow, that stinks. All right, now try and rest, okay? Now try the rest. Spacer's choice. Oh, law. That stinks. Oh, that's what he said. Oh, that's embarrassing. That's what he said. <clears throat> Sit still and I'll patch you up. I can do this. I got you. Huh. Looks like the bleeding stopped. I owe you one. Hope you don't mind me omitting this little exchange for my report. Spacer's Choice doesn't like us accepting outside help. Uh, okay, well, first of all, I need to ask you, Spacer's what? Oh, we're all part of the Spacer's Choice family here. Not that I deserve to be. Can't even deliver a company slogan. We were out on patrol. I saw a marauder camp up in the hills. Thought I could take them. Then my gun misfired. Right through my side. I mean, what are the odds of that, right? Just barely scraped by with my life. Crawled in here and blocked off the exit with those canisters. Okay, well, what's this about marauders? Gibbering, flesh-eating, law-breaking, unemployed lunatics with guns. Some hull had grounded their spacecraft out in the open. That's a real good way to attract marauders. See those canisters by the entrance? Marauders come sniffing around in here, and I can take them all out with a single shot. Not bad, huh? That's actually pretty smart. I'll tell you what. Someone grounded their ship here illegally? How about I hunt them down for you, okay? How about that? You'd better take my gun, then. Uh, careful. It's worth more to the company than I am. Here, you can have my saber, too, for patching me up and all. All Spacer's Choice weapons are now 30% less likely to malfunction. You've tried the best, now try the rest. Spacer's Choice. Yes, nailed it that time. I don't think you understand that saying does not help your company's cause. Can you tell me where the hell I am? You hit your head or something? You're in Emerald Vale. We're a Spacer's Choice community. Edgewater's a little ways down. A pretty place in the Vale. Be sure to stop by a provisioner's for a can of our famous salt tuna. Ugh, salt tuna. That sounds disgusting. Do you know anything about the Hope? The Hope? Is that some sort of fancy new drug? Are you with Auntie Cleo or something? Don't take this the wrong way or nothing, but I'm not allowed to fraternize with Cleo workers. Company policy. Okay, um, I'm out of here. All right. I see the attack. This is where we want to get people to come. That is a pretty good idea. That is a pretty good idea you got there, friend. Maybe I can talk the marauders into coming in there. Do I have to blow that up in order to move forward? Alright, here we go. It's Seems like a bad idea. Damn it, my ears! Oh, what just happened? Can you hear me? What in the hell? This... I can't hear you too well. Bad reception. Bad reception. Uh oh, one of those horrifying things is happening with my brain. What is this? Tactical time dilation? Ooh, I like the idea of this. Hibernation complications detected. Due to complications stemming from being revived after an extended hibernation, your brain processes time differently. Pressing the tactical time dilation. Oh, this is, this is just, uh, what is it called from Fallout? Oh, cool. So basically it's like using your Pip-Boy, but they've got a functionality that's a little different. I like it. I like it. I 
wonder how many of them there are. I'll just wait for that other guy to come back, and I'll get them both in my time dilation. Maybe that guy's not coming back. Oh boy! That's not what I thought was going to happen. Oh shoot. Am I just going to die here? Run away! Oh damn it all to hell. Oh! Holy moly! I guess I'll heal up. Double click the space jump to space bar to jump. Oh. All right, well, this is good news for me. Bit cartridge, what's that? A bit cartridge storing amounts of bits used as currency. Oh, I'll take that. And then light ammo, that makes sense. And rebuilt mining gear. You have a new item in your inventory. Fair. More bit cartridges, light ammo. Piecemeal mining helmet. All right. I guess I should heal up one more time. Yeah, that did escalate very quickly. I was kind of thinking that if I just snuck up to him and, like, shot him in the back, he'd be dead. And that's why I, like, put the slow motion on. I had no idea. I had no idea. This is very different than Fallout New Vegas. Oh, oh, oh I don't want to use it. That doesn't look like me. That doesn't look like me at all. Uh, okay, it does look a little like me. But not in the ways, not in the good ways. I think I, it's actually good to have the extra outfit, but I think the stealth is more important. All right, let's sneak up on this next son of a bitch. Uh, the next one's gonna die a lot easier than the last. Or the other option is doing a little bit of reconnaissance. I don't know if it's reconnaissance. Pick up magnet, zero G brew. Tarmac and cheese. Mag pick. I wonder if that's a lock pick, but for magnets. Oh, these are space bananas and a space apple. And another mag pick. Mag picks are used to break open locks and bypass shunts. Are used to break back, uh, break computer encryptions. Okay, shunts and mag picks. That makes sense. Raising your skill will lower the amount of items used and speed up the process. Well, that's cool. Hold for three seconds. It's going to take three to use. I might as well. Telescoping staff. I'll take it. I might as well. I used my mag picks on it. Fish sticks. I'll put fish sticks in my mouth. It's all just food. Those blankets don't need to be taken. I guess I don't have to cook anything or else they would give me options for cooking here. All right. Isn't there a quick attack for these guys? I wonder if that other guy saw me. I guess not. He's still walking forward. I guess I'll get up into this grass here. Oh, I think he's coming around. 
Oh, he is. Uh-oh. That was it. That was it. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, 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 shit. Okay. I got this. Oh. Well, I'll take that. Okay, I'll take it all. I'll take it all. I got that. I guess that guy didn't have anything on him. That's all he had. I like the knife a lot better than the gun, but I guess it depends on what kind of situation you're in. Is this the ship? Well, I guess I see why the Marauders are all here. It's a nice ship. Here before you get yourself killed. Wow, you're tall. Don't know where you came from, stranger, but you best keep your head down. There's marauders hereabouts, and worse, landing violators. Call on that rung leech. Landing in the veil without using an official spacer's choice landing pad. I'd slap him with a fine if it weren't for all these marauders shambling about. Listen, it's just a landing violation. Let it go. Get out of your mind? No way. Once we've dealt with these marauders, I'm hunting that sick freak down. I just, you know, need a couple of winks to catch my breath. Stretch my legs some. I'll tell you what. Do Spacer's Choice Guards back down from a challenge ever? Well, sometimes. Management's real right. getting cost-benefit analysis. But... Seeing as I'm the acting manager in this situation, you know what? You're right. It's time we cross those marauders off, find whoever owns that ship, and file a full report. Then it's gonna be fucking laminated. Well, that's not what I was actually trying to say. Okay, I guess we'll take these marauders out. Not what I meant to do. Get off! Reloading! No! And this guy's dead. Oh, wait, you can pop a head off. I didn't think it was possible. So this ship here is going to be mine, huh? I don't understand why people need permits to land. I mean, there's no reason to be rude. Canid Skullfin. All right. And Canid Meat. The bone protrusion from the top of a Canid Skull. All right. I'll take it and I'll take it. My guess is it's worth something. All right, guys. It looks like maybe it's just abandoned. Why don't we Rochambeau for who gets to win it? Who gets to keep it forever? This Come is going to take a lot of paperwork. I, you don't have to do all the paperwork. Just let me take it. I need a ship. This is going to take a lot of paperwork. Please be informed that this vessel contains no valuable plunder. Okay. So I can fast travel here. It's nice to know that there is a fast travel. Welcome aboard. Welcome Smile aboard. Smile my surveillance device, Marauder. I am tracking your every move. I'm not a Marauder. I'm friends with the guy that owned this ship. Uh, there was a mistake. He was holding All a beacon like a dum dum. Security lockdown. Nice try, Marauder. I'm not a Marauder. Where, oh, where, oh, where is the doorway? This is... Unauthorized okay. access of space-faring vessels is a crime. Hello, Marauder. I am Ada, the autonomous digital astrogator of this vessel. Please be informed that I am authorized to use violent retribution against unwanted solicitors. 
Please return any misappropriated equipment and exit this vessel in an orderly fashion. Failure to do so will result in your immediate destruction. Let me save you some time, Ada. I survived GLaDOS. I am not afraid of a psycho uh, robot. So what are you going to do? Self-destruct on me? Register procedures initiated. Disengage in airlocks. Prepare to reject all foreign parties inside. Whoa, oh, oh, wait, 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 wait. We can talk this over. We can talk this over. <laughs> You realize we're on the ground, right? You are still here. My deception protocols have failed. I have oh, been geez. programmed to express disappointment. Listen, I need to get this ship into the air. I'm sure you don't want to be on the ground. Your natural state is flying, isn't it, ship? I am incapable of accepting orders from anyone other than Captain Alex Hawthorne. All right, well, we can reason with this. Uh, I'm really sorry to be the one to tell you. I'm sure you guys have a long relationship together. But Hawthorne's I dead. I will require some time to process this information. Thank you for your patience and for your honesty. I am programmed to take orders exclusively from Captain Hawthorne. If I accept your orders, then you must be Captain Hawthorne. Do you understand? I get it. You need to, me to be Captain Hawthorne, or you can't fly. That's that's the condition. Well done, Captain Hawthorne. Okay. I see your powers of deductive reasoning remain intact. Unfortunately, our engine is currently inoperable. Our main drive suffered a critical power failure, and we were forced to make an emergency landing. The main drive's power regulator has been irreparably damaged and must be replaced. Where am I supposed to find something like that, Ada? The settlement of Edgewater is located nearby. I recommend speaking to the administrator of Edgewater and requesting assistance. I have taken the liberty of printing you a new captain's identity cartridge. Please try not to lose it this time. This cartridge identifies you, Alex Hawthorne, as the registered proprietor and captain of the Unreliable. Do you understand? I do understand, Ada. Thank you. I Best get it. Best of luck in your search for a power regulator. Try to stay alive this time. <laughs> You're so cute. You're so cute. I like you, Ada. You're bad, but I like you. I've leveled up. All right, great. So congratulations. You've gained experience enough to go up a level. Open your character ledger to advance your character. Leveling up skills. I mean, this is all... This isn't my first video game. Like I said, I faced off against GLaDOS and survived. Skill improvements. Every time you level up, you earn skill points to spend on improving your skills. Spending skill points on a core skill like melee improves all specialized skills in that group up to a maximum of 50. After 50, you can add points directly to a specialized skill up to 100. Oh, kind of cool. That's new. Kind of reminds me of um, sort of like a more sophisticated role-playing game style. Every skill improves as it grows, but special unlocked bonuses occur every 20 points. Read each skill description to see what they are. Armor, consumables, status effects can temporarily raise and lower your skills. This helps or hurts. Okay, that's fine. I get it. Oh. So, I guess what I would do is I'm going to probably want to keep going with the dialogue. Let's put one more into here. Oh, I got nine more points there. I'll do melee. Uh, some leadership, some tech. Oh, do I need to do, I got four more points, maybe perks? Oh, all changes will be lost. Come on, back, 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 back. Okay, I got four more points. And do one more melee. That's it. You'll be unable to undo point allocations afterwards. I'm fine with that. Companion abilities. You can command your companions to use their special abilities 
Companionability one, C and V. All right, that's good to know. I don't have any companions. Time dilation, location hits. You've unlocked the location hit effects for tactical time. To hitting enemies in different locations, maims, cripples. Oh, I get that. That's great. I was worried that that was missing from the game. Try different locations to see the effects. Combat dialogue abilities. You have unlocked a dialogue combat skill. When attacking the correct type of target, they are automatically debilitated. I don't even know what that means. Cool. I guess I should have been reading this stuff. So I got Persuade. Humans have 20% chance to cower in fear for three seconds after you hit them the first time. Oh, wow. That's awesome. Scramble chance to auto, auto mechanicals will slowly attack other enemies instead of you for 10 seconds. Intimidate. 20%. 20% chance the creatures will become terrified and flee for 10 seconds after you kill one. Well, that's great. But I didn't get to 20 on any of these. Heavy weapons I did unlock. Oh, so only with heavy weapons can I get that? I guess I should have want, I wanted to get to the next level for that. Inspiration, companions... Order them to do things. Oh, good. Oh, I didn't realize that was the case. And determination. The inhaler heals you and your companions, but they get 30% of the healing effect. All right, great. Perks. Selecting perks. Welcome to the perk selection. You get a new perk point every time to spend every two levels. You can also acquire a perk point through gameplay, such as accepting a flaw, acquiring... Five new perks makes the next tier of perks available for you. All right, let's see here. 50% base health. That's awesome. 50% from companion kills. Uh, that seems like the gift that keeps on giving. I'm totally taking the XP from companions. It's too good to pass up. The earlier the better. I know I don't have any companions, but eventually. <clears throat> and I guess we can back out now. <laughs>